as soon as the word product launch is mentioned, this is what comes to mind. Every time, people think of the glitz, the glamour, or the excitement. Let's just remove that for a moment. Here's why. That's important. Glitz, glamour is important. But ultimately, what's important is that the product gets sell through. Whatever it is, it gets sell through. So what we find today is we need a bit of a blend between the glitz, the glitz, and the reality of how it works. Let me give you an example. Tire manufacturers have a great deal of difficulty getting their tire retailers to support their product because there are so many brands available, etc. So back a little while ago, one manufacturer had a glitzy one, you know? One of those with all the stuff happening. I went along and had a look. It was fantastic. They had double screens and the tires were talked about. Then people walked down the back and they had a little bit of something to eat and they smelled and touched and felt the tires and they went back to their dealerships. And guess what? Not many were sold. Why? Because they didn't understand where they lived in the marketplace and how to do it. I had a tire manufacturer come to me and say, how do we do it differently? And that's what I love, that opportunity. So what we did was we identified what was originally on these vehicles, what profile of customer would buy the tyre that they had, the new tyre they had. Then we matched the two together, we went to a track, we worked out how we could do back-to-back -back testing, side-by-side -side testing, show the difference. Then I created an actual format that enabled the guys to come out to the track, test this tyre, test this tyre, understand how that profile of customer would buy it for that reason on those sort of vehicles, and then right at the end, we made sure that they're aware of how to do that and what they'd put in stock. What we finished up happening was that tyre manufacturer sold more tyres into and through those tyre dealers than the other one. Why? Because, well, they both had some glitz. The second one, probably not as much. But then again, the guys that were at it really wanted to know how to show the customer the value of this product. And that's what we did at the release. So product launchers, yes, they need some glitz. But you need to turn, turn that glitz into outcome. And that is by getting an execution process. So my bag is about selling. My bag is about increasing the the receptiveness of those who are going to sell the product and how to do it and execute the strategy. So it starts from way back with the product, where it lives in the marketplace, who, how it's going to be sold. That's what makes a product launch really rock, getting the outcome.